All right, so I already primed my eye with the Milani Eyeshadow Primer. I'm going to start off using this uh, limited edition color tattoo in Lavish Lavender. And I'm using this as a base. So this time I'm using my finger. Sometimes I use a brush. It depends on like the texture and how the finish comes out. But I tried to use it with the brush before with my other eye. And it was coming out kind of sheer. So when we using my finger and just like dabbing it on, it shows up a little better. And this one really isn't like a duochrome like the other ones. It's like a lavender, silvery, frosty color. So. And it's not even really like a real lavender, lavender. Just like a, to me, like just like a little tint of it. Okay. So I'm going to start off with this color from Bitch Slap Cosmetics. It is this light purple color right here. I don't know the name of it since it came in the tower. And I don't remember the name of this tower. So I will try to look it up and leave it in the description. And this is what it looks like. So I'm just patting this on. About the first half or two thirds of the eye. And I haven't done this side of my face, the foundation or anything yet, because this um, pigment right here has a lot of fallout. A lot of the glitter falls out of this one, so. Okay, so we're going to do about that much. Next color I'm using is the OTM color from Glamour Doll Eyes. It's called s and It's the May OTM for this year. Just came out. Just got it a few days ago. And it is like almost a black color. But they described it as a really, really like blackish purple. So I'm going to be placing this on the outer V. And into on to um on the lid as well. And I use tape today because I did want um a defined line or edge. So you're gonna bring that in the rest of the way and blend it in with the first color. Okay. Next, I'm going to be using Texture by MAC. This color right here. No, that's brown script, sorry, right here. I'm also going to be using rice paper for my highlight. <clears throat> so I'm using Texture in the crease to blend out 
the lime. Now I'm putting on rice paper. Alright, so now I'm about to go back and put some more color from wherever I probably wiped it away. I'm getting the S&M first. And I'm also going to, I have some on the brush now. I'm also going to spray with some Fix Plus by MAC to deepen up the color. Okay, and I'm going to get some more of the other purple color from Bitch Slap. So you should have that line right there. I'm going to take my little kabuki brush from Beach Cosmetic and brush away the fallout. I'm about to line my bottom water line with my Sephora Cold Liner in black. And I'm also going to use my eye cream by BH Cosmetics and Royalty. I'm placing that right under the other eyeliner. Using this for a base. Now I'm going to be using this top color right here from the um B not the BH the Bitch Slap Cosmetics Tower. This top color I'm using to put in my tear duct. That's what it looks like. And I love um Bitch Slap Cosmetics. They like for real fill their uh their pigment um containers like this is full. I don't have any that comes this full. Not from another company. Put some over here. Okay, now I'm going to get a little bit of this bottom purple color that I put on the lid. I'm going to place that at the bottom using the same brush.
and now I'm going to get the color from Glamour Doll Eyes, the S&M color that I put on the outer V at the top. Okay. And now I'm going to line my top water line, lash line, put on my mascara and my lashes, and I will be right back. Alright, so I'm back, you guys. Um, the lashes I used today are my Red Cherry number 62s. And on my lips, I have quite a few things. I have on um, my Heroin Lip Liner by MAC. My purple liner by Wet n Wild. So I put the purple on first. And then I have put this color from the Betty Collection. And this is Girl Next Door. So it's a really, really light pink color. And then I have put on the heroin on top of that. And then last I have put on my nude Peach Fuzz by NYX. This is the Extreme Lip Cream. Because... That color, this was not giving me what I was looking for. So, I had to do all that little concoction to it. But yeah, this is the look. And I hope you guys like it. And check out my other video for the um, review for the Glamour Doll Eyes collection for this month's The May OTM. And I also talk about the blush that they sent me which came in this pretty, pretty packaging. Alright, so you guys, make sure you guys are following me on Instagram and Keek at Juju's Glam House. Facebook, Juju's Glam House. I am on Twitter, but I don't hardly use it. So you can follow me on there if you like. And until next time, I will see you guys later. Bye!